I am Melissa Todd, and I'm a psychologist in Eugene, Oregon, and this is why I left an insurance network. So I started working with a young woman, and after getting to know her for a little bit, I recognized that she was reporting symptoms of bipolar disorder. There were times when she had suicidal ideations. Six months into our treatment, I received a call um, from United Healthcare saying that they wanted to do a clinical review. And um, you know, they they asked a question at the end. They wanted to know when she would be done with treatment. And I found that question strange because she had a chronic mental illness that is lifelong and requires essentially you know lifelong management. And so you know, this particular insurance company had been, um, you know, doing all kinds of things for a long period of time to make providers want want to leave. I don't want to speak for other people, but it made me want to leave. Um, they were a very low payer. Um, you know, you had the, these frequent clinical reviews and the reviews usually come with your most seriously ill patients because, you know, you're seeing them more often or you're seeing them for a longer period of time. So not only are you doing the harder work with, you know, to to treat these folks, getting, you know, paid the lowest amounts, but then you're also essentially getting, getting you know, borderline harassed for the, you know, and, and pressured to reduce care. And so I felt like I needed to leave this network in order to be able to provide appropriate care to not just this client, but other clients. I was put in a situation where I had to make a choice that felt um, that, that, that felt like it went against my one of my values, which was to provide, you know, affordable and accessible care. But I left the network in order to be able to be aligned with another value, which is providing the people that I work with, with the care that is appropriate for their situation.